God had to restore it. So God sent His only Son, sent Jesus Christ to us. But for us to get back to the place where we could be like Adam and Eve, without guilt, without condemnation, without fear, God had to send His only Son and take away sicknesses so that we can be healed like Adam and Eve. He had to take away all unrighteousness. Jesus died. His blood flowed on the cross. He washed us clean to be exactly like Adam and Eve. But we are not going to be like Adam and Eve. We're going to be better than what they were because we will not be able to miss it. And this is what I want to close with. Even though Adam and Eve were in the presence of God, or they were, walked with God, everything was perfect. They, didn't, they never had to work. Everything was fine. They lost their faith and they missed it. A man a while ago asked me, but Jamon, if we all go to heaven, won't we also be able to miss it? And I said, we might. And he said, what do you mean? I said, Adam and Eve was never under the blood of Jesus. <laughs> Just think about it again. <laughs> do you understand who you are? You are under the blood of Jesus. Even if you make a mistake, it's okay. You are under his blood. Jesus didn't die for your sins in your past life. He died for the sins that you still might do. That's how perfect His grace is. That's why it's called the gift, free gift of righteousness. But because I have received this gift, I don't say, okay, I can just do whatever I want. No, because I have received this gift, I really treat it as a gift. When me and my wife got married, the Lord told me, your wife is a gift that I'm giving you. Treat her as a gift always. And I've never forgotten that, never. I will always treat her as a gift, a free gift God has given me. I didn't deserve her, I got her as a gift. So all we have to do now is just believe in Jesus. Just believe in the cross. Just believe in Him.